Hi, this is Noah Bowling at the Graham Farm and Nature Center in Jackson County, Alabama. We're here at our privet removal demonstration site to uh, tell you a few different methods to chemically control privet. Um, the, the season to chemically control privet is starting in uh, summer to early winter. Here you can see a uh, dense wall of privet hedge along this uh, large hay field. Uh, moving along here, you can see our first chemical control um, plot here. We've used, uh, you, you, can, you can get these results by using a backpack sprayer using glyphosate at 41% at a 2-5% to solution. Here we are at our cut stump application. For this technique, you cut the privet stump at the base with a chainsaw, loppers, or even a handsaw. Always remembering to use proper safety equipment such as chainsaw chaps, uh, gloves, and safety goggles. Immediately following the cut, always spray the, the stump with 41% uh, glyphosate at a 50% solution. Uh, also use a marker die so that you can tell which stump you've already sprayed and which ones you haven't. Here we are at our last demonstration site, a basil bark application. Uh, this technique involves a uh, spraying the lower bottom of each and every privet uh, stem all around the entire circumference of, of each plant. This is achieved using a 20% solution of triclopyr ester in an oil carrier. Now with any pesticide application, always remember to read and follow the label. For more information on managing Chinese privet, see our publication Controlling Chinese Privet or see your local extension agent or office.